Alright, welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. We are gonna continue on with the game. Jump down this crap. And let's go left. Yeah, it's left. Alright. And dude, because we're super cool, we're gonna look at her and go backwards. No, I just wanna go backwards in general. Oh yeah, look how cool we are. We missed. God damn it! Alright. So my idea is that we get a few, like, uh, that bottle in Kakariko. I'm gonna get that damn freaking... Oh, it's nighttime? I guess that makes sense. But, uh, then I actually want that freaking piece of heart that I didn't get before. I don't know if you play Epona's song or if you play freaking Zelda's Lullaby. I always say you play Zelda's Lullaby. It's that freaking white dog and then life is good. Okay, and then after that, I think, uh, we've got to go around city, do all the awesome random shenanigans and stuffs, and we'll be good. We'll go do Dodongo's Cavern. Oh my god! <laughs> Link's so cool, he jumps backwards when he doesn't even need to. And randomly pulls out his sword and... Starts going boom boom. Alright. Okay. Now we're gonna do sides. Because we're cool like that too. Whoa, we kinda glitched up there for a second. I like how I'm acting like I'm speedrunning this game, but I'm like not at all. <laughs> I just don't wanna wait through the time that it takes to walk over. Uh freaking I need to see nice time. Do 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 do. You played the sun song. Okay, I'm gonna see. Okay, Zelda's all about. Follow me, puppy. Follow me. Okay, the puppy finally got to follow me. Sweet. I think it's over here. No, that's Temple of Time, but Maybe it's over here. Come on, puppy. Come on, white puppy. Of oh, death. Of oh, death. Yeah, I just make it more epic. Basically, we go in here, and she's like, Hey, here's Pizarro. Richard! <laughs> this is my little Richard. Really? Little Richard. Whatever. <laughs> okay, piece of heart. That's our first piece of heart, actually. I know that's exciting and all. All right, and now let's go to, back to Kakariko. I went the freaking one that was completely the wrong way. Random pup. I thought that puppy was following me, but he's going in a circle and randomly barking at nothing. <laughs> Uh, AI. Okay. Oh yeah, it's night time. Do -do 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 -do. Hurry up. Yes. <laughs> I like how it somehow transports me back. Can I do the backwards thing here? <laughs> Crap, you can. It just isn't really easy target. It's pretty funny. Alright. Let's go all the way back to Kakarai Girl. And if any of you guys have a problem with it, you can just shoot her up. I want to go to Kakarai Girl. And then eventually we're going to have to go to Goron City. And after Goron City, we have to do the Dongo's Cavern. And after the Dongo's Cavern, we have to go to Lake Kilia. And after Lake Kilia, we have to go to Zora's Domain. And whatever. <laughs> and Jab Jab. Jab Jab. Jibba jibba. Speaking of which, there's all. Oh, whoops. I meant to pick you up, not hit you. Chicken, I'm sorry I sliced you with a sword. That was three friends. We can get a bottle, I wanna say? Um. Back here. So let's go get that bottle. Look at these cuckoos. Cuckoos. 
Okay, basically you get to get like, I want to say like seven cuckoos, but the only, they're pretty laid out. The only ones that are hard to find, you actually have to go over here. <laughs> and then basically you just throw them all over here. There's like two of them over here you have to throw over, and then you can just start collecting them. There's a hole in the wall, or a ground too, which I fell into a few times by accident. It's like one, I know there's one down here, I don't know if there's one on the edge or not. We have to go get a, you have to use a chicken to go get this chicken. Or a cuckoo. They couldn't call them chickens, because that would make too much sense. Boom! Alright. So, where's these other cuckoos? Uh, here's one. Yeah, I know there's one up here. I just thought that was. Well, I think that there's not another one up here, so we can just use an epic fly down technique to get this shit in there. Watch, this is gonna be from an action movie. Ready? You ready? Are you ready? Are you ready? Are you ready? Action movie! Oh my god! Oh, chicken! <laughs> I don't know why I think that's badass. I almost threw him out. Whoops. Okay, let's get these two chickens in. I like how the other chickens are on our way when they see what they think of being another chicken's life in peril. Or cuckoos, I keep messing up. They're called cuckoos on chickens. Okay. There's another one. I like how I even talk to her, I just automatically assume that she needs these chickens. They're cuckoos. Damn it. Alright, and then there's another secret one over here, you just gotta do this, kinda. Oops. Stay still. What the frick? Stupid classic controller, I swear. Now I'm angry. Just gonna randomly frickin' spam until it works. There we go. Cuckoo! <laughs> that was actually kind of an epic camera angle for a second there. Cannot deny that was pretty epic. Alright, let's get this one. I don't know why they put a cuckoo in a box. God dang. Come here, damn chicken. Okay, there we go. Wait, wait, wait. There we go. Uh, I gotta turn around. Damn easy targeting. I hate you. Nah, I don't. They're one of the best ideas anybody, anybody's ever come up with for 3D games. <laughs> oh, 3D solders, I guess. Okay, let's do this. Oh, I didn't want to talk to you. Okay, I think there's one more chicken over here. I think this is the last one. So let's go nab it. Yeah. Alright. And then she should give us a bottle. Yep. Thank you for finding my cuckoos. I have allergies so I get goosebumps when I touch them. Why do you even freaking have cuckoos if you have allergies? Jesus Christ. How do you take care of them? You're like the... I don't understand why you picked that as your profession. <laughs> you're allergic to them. What if a Link, er, not a Link, Link was allergic to him too, and then, yeah, after you're doing that bottle, you're like, your hands swell up and crap, you can't use your sword. That'd be like the stupidest plot device ever. But it'd be kind of fun. God damn it. Alright, let's see, what else do we need to do? Um, can't really think of much. So I guess we go up back. Go up here. Let's go to Goron City. Do, do, do. We didn't really need to do that bottle, but it's always nice having bottles. If I do say so myself, at least. Alright, so let's go climb up Death Mountain Trail. Which is pretty intense, I'm not gonna lie. Whoa, whoa. I'm trying to remember, I was like, is, what piece of heart would be good to get before? Or, um, because I usually, I know you can get two and go on, well, 
One in Goron City and one after. I'm trying to think. I would like to have five parts put forward to dong those. You don't need to, but I guess it would be nice. Oh, goddamn, I hate these damn Gorons. <laughs> I mean, I like Gorons, but I don't like them when they're all up in my grill. Yeah, I just, I'm white and I just had all up in my grill. You have a problem? Okay. Goron City. Okay. Since we already got Sorry a song, we can now do Goron City. And I think you really only need Sorry a song, so. Uh, and Zelda, obviously Zelda's lullaby, but. It's like, they hand you, they spoon feed you Zelda's lullaby. They don't spoon feed you Sorry a song. So. Alright, and then you go in here, and then. If I'm correct, you play freaking. I always forget how to play Sorry a song. I played this game millions of times, but I always freaking end up playing this sun song. Down, right, left, okay. <laughs> I don't know why, it's a problem. There you go. And then this freaking Dodongo, like, Dodongo. This freaking Goron goes crazy. <laughs> this is him dancing, this, he's getting his groove on right here. Oh yeah. <laughs> kind of funny if you ask me. That's his dance, the Ow. Or, oh. Oh, oh. Oh, oh. Come on! Come on, come on, come on. I think he would be having, like... I don't... I don't know. <laughs> He's getting way too excited about this. At least I haven't played the song anymore. <laughs> hey, what a nice tune. Just like that. My depression is all gone. Something that just came over me. I suddenly wanted to dance like crazy. I'm Darunia. I'm the big boss of the Gorons. Is there something you wanted to ask me about? What? You wanted the spiritual stone of fire too? The spiritual stone of fire, also known as the Gorons Ruby, is our race's hidden treasure. Hold on, I'm not going to give it to you that easily. If you want it so badly, why don't you... Blunt. Okay. <laughs> Why don't you destroy monsters inside of Dodongo's cavern and provide, prove you're a real man? Ugh. That way. <laughs> I think that, I think freaking Darunia is also kind of a pervert. I want a real man. Oh yeah. <laughs> or a pedophile or something. Anyways, if you wear this, even little fella like you can pick up bomb flowers. Okay, this upgrade's kind of useless, but... It's just basically so you can pick up bomb flowers. They can't just give you bombs right away. No, they have to give you this thing so you can pick up bomb flowers. So, alright. Let's go get the, the shenanigans. And we'll do... Let's see. Pull out the uh, Deku sticks. And we'll save it for next part.